Hello scrapbookers, this is Megan and I am back today with a new Cheeky Studio design team layout. So for this one, I'm going to be using the new birthday wishes collection. It's actually just called Wishes, um, but it's a birthday collection that Tuesday designed and it is absolutely amazing and gorgeous. And I recently had my birthday back in April and so I thought it would be fun to actually scrapbook those pictures because I never really scrapbook pictures of my birthday. Um, I don't know why. Um, I just don't really scrapbook that much about myself. So we actually went down to a city that's about 45 minutes away on my birthday and we went and ate at my favorite rest or my favorite fast food burrito place, which is Chipotle. And, um, then I, so I took a picture of that and then Mark made me an amazing steak dinner and also a homemade cheesecake for my birthday cake. So, um, and then I took pictures of the cards that they, the kids gave me and Mark gave me. And then the, the picture of me in a shirt is a shirt that the kids, uh, gave me. They gave me a different color. It was more purple um, than blue and I had to exchange it because the purple one had a hole in it and it was like a humongous hole. It made me very sad. Anyway, you can see here that I have a lot of photos. So I am trying to add the frames um, to give a little bit more of um, decoration behind the photos because I didn't want to mat every single photo since there were so many of them. So I really love how um, the frames look and they kind of um, just add another layer uh, behind the photos without having to actually use paper or anything like that. So you can see I'm just kind of playing around with the embellishments from the Wishes Ephemera Pack. She also, this collection, um, with this collection, she has a few sheets of digital designs, um, like labels and circles and I think banners that you can use or buy. They are just a digital download and then you print it off yourself. Um... Since I'm on the design team, Tuesday actually did print off all of us design team gals our own copy and so that we could kind of show you what it looks like. And um, I really had a lot of fun. I used my silhouette to um, cut them out. I just used my pic scan and it worked out pretty good. So I'm also going to use this cute little purple gingham bow in each one of my clusters. So I'm going to have three different clusters. I'm working on the first one right here and I really like how that turns out. I keep it super simple. I'm adding one of those digital label pieces and I'm just going to put the date on there eventually. Now I'm going to start gluing everything down in the bottom right hand corner, all of the photos and the frames and here I'm thinking, okay, I need a place for a title and what do I want my title to be? And also as part of this uh, collection pack or kit, um, you get these two by two squares um, or sayings and this one says, oh gosh, I can't remember wishes do come true or something like that I think and I just thought that was perfect because um, we don't always make it down to um, this town to go and do things because it's like 45 minutes away and we're very much homebody type of people but um, for my birthday we decided to make the trip because Chipotle is like my absolute favorite burrito place and so we decided to go there for lunch and it was just a fun day um, traveling down there and then spending some time down there shopping and and um, we went to Costco while we were down there and I think 
maybe a couple other places. I don't really remember, but the main trip was for Chipotle. <laughs> So here you can see I'm just gluing all those pieces down and that's pretty much what this layout is. I'm just going to add a few um, pieces from the kit that I got and glue everything down and then that's my layout. Um, I really love those circle uh, digital shapes. They were a lot of fun to add to each cluster. And here you can see I just have everything kind of spread out around on my desk from the um, the ephemera pack and all the different ephemera packs and digital cut files and everything. So here I'm adding to this bottom right hand cluster. And I wanted to make sure that I had a circle in each one of the clusters as well as a bow. Here is where I actually change it up and I decided to do flowers in each cluster. And there's going to be four different clusters. Um, so there's that bottom right hand cluster. There's the kind of middle-ish left hand cluster. Then there's the top right hand cluster. And then I'm going to do a top left hand cluster. I did really love that raccoon that I placed there in that top right hand cluster, but it's just one of those random embellishments that didn't really go with the theme of the layout. So I just couldn't do it. I love it and I think it's super duper cute and I can't wait to find a layout to put it on. So this is actually the end of my layout. I stepped away to go uh, help with dinner or something like that and I didn't end up coming back but I kept recording obviously. So um, I will have some photos at the end of what the layout looked like. For some reason my video software corrupted the last video that I did. I don't think I change it up too much. I add a little bit of journaling and a few more embellishments but that is it. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you will check out these products. Make sure you use my code Code, uh, which is capital C crafty Maggie 10. Thanks so much. Bye.